What up, y'all? I'm headed to job number two. I did not come this morning. Why I didn't come this morning? I don't know. I probably just didn't feel like it. Idiot, what a deal. And so, headed to job number two. My boss, well, one of my bosses, you know, I had three different bosses this year. She brought me Christmas gifts. And next year, I guess I'll buy them gifts because I wasn't prepared to buy gifts this year because I really, at my last job, we didn't do stuff like that. So, they more family oriented here so I need to get my life but this is what the car look like isn't that cute little dog with his thing Merry Christmas just generic super cute let's see what she got me let's see. this is the bag super cute. just says Merry Christmas a reusable bag she got me a cat or a dog what is this this cute but dangerous pet fits into your keychain and are hand in a moment or and are at hand in a home in a moment's notice notice. The ears of the pets are danger points. The eyes are your finger holes to take hold of the pet. Remember, strike and run. Oh, it's like a safety thing. That's cute. I'm gonna open it up. So it looks like this, see? But if somebody's attacking you, you put your hands through the Yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh, that was not a cute face capture. When traveling, please put this in your check luggage. It will not pass through security. Okay. So freaking cute. Look at that. So like mess with me if you want to. That's nice, y'all. So I need that. Every girl needs one that. What is this? Keyboard brush and LED screen cleaner. That's cute. Clean the buzz out of your keyboard. Two-in-one computer, keyboard monitor, clean accessory, and the LED pool. Oh, ooh, wow! I didn't even know they made stuff like that. So it looks like this. Y'all can see that. It's cute. It got like some little B or something. Oh yeah, buzz for B. Doug Kiosha. I'm such a retard. Then I got some stress relief body lotion. Stress relief body lotion from Bath and Body Works. Vanilla Verbena. Ooh, that smells good. Hand sanitizer. Gotta keep germ free around here. And some jasmine soap, I'm assuming. I don't know. I'm actually allergic to scented soap, so I might can't use this. But it's the thought that counts, right? Isn't that right? Then she just had this cute paper in it. And stuff that in there. So that's cute. Appreciate it. Let's get out of this parking lot. So. I think I brought the, I apologize last night for my cussing rant. I apologize again. <laughs> If you know the old Kiyoshi, you would not have been surprised at all. Um, but I'm headed to job number two. Oh, I gotta get gas. I only got 43 miles worth of gas. And you guys, yesterday I was so lazy. And I should have stopped when I went to see my uncle. Because gas over there, where he was, was $2. And by the time I got to my house, it was $2.21. So your girl finna make a pit stop over by my uncle house and get this $2 gas. And hope... That it's still two dollars today like because it could not be two dollars because i was tripping but i hope it's still two dollars though so i'm gonna head over there and get that before i sold to the second job go ahead and fill up because i have to drive tomorrow i have to do a lot of driving tomorrow um see how much gas money i got left y'all we have got to talk about me and my non uh keeping of my cash envelopes so your girl is using her cash but I'm doing stupid stuff so 25 30 1 32 33 34 35 36 37 38 39 40 41 42 43 44 45 46 47 48 49 50 51 52 53 51 only have 54 dollars supposed to have 60 
because probably most supposed to have more than 60. So what I was doing, you guys, I was dipping and dabbing, which is what you're not supposed to do in the cash envelopes. You're not supposed to dip and dab. So I told you guys I don't take my whole wallet with me. And so what I'm going to have to do is make a conscious decision next year that if I don't have the money to buy whatever I want to buy out of that category, I just can't get it because me dipping and dabbing, I get confused. I don't write it down. I don't know where I borrowed the money from out of the grocery fund, out of the fund fund. Like I'm not keeping a record of who to pay back. So in that case, that means that Kyosha needs not to be borrowed and dipping out of nothing since you can't remember where you got the money from that makes sense so ain't gonna be none of that in 2018 and then in groceries i have two i have 80 dollars left in groceries my mama bought so much meat and i'm very appreciative of that um so i have 80 dollars left and we still have just well all of next week and that's it so i definitely won't be using a whole 80 dollars i might use like 50 probably not even that much because we really only need sides and to tell you the truth i haven't been home i've been working overtime Okay, I got $20 in a household, and I think we need some toilet tissue. Uh, I need some toothpaste in my bathroom, which means the children probably need toothpaste in their bathroom. Unless my mama bought some. Sometimes she'll buy it. And I think we need some dishwashing liquid. I think that's it. I don't know if we need no, no laundry detergent, um, but I can wait on that. But I do need to give me some more toothpaste. Um, but yes, I was dipping and dabbing. And your girl can't be dipping and dabbing no more. So that's not that's not that's not the business, Kiosha. Um, <clears throat> so I have a couple of things to do. I think for this last, you know, I was really, really strict on my budget and I've got actually laxed on it lately for the last like couple of weeks. So I need to get that together. Like January is gonna be back at the budget intense Kiosha. Like, I think I got relaxed because I knew I had money in the bank. I knew I had this. And I definitely went over my Christmas budget. But the overtime helped with that because it really didn't come out. I still was able to do what I planned in that month because the overtime took up the extra money I spent in my Christmas budget. But I could have used that money for something else. So i still not proud of doing that. Like, I could have took that overtime money and used it somewhere else more productive instead of using it to pay extra in Christmas gifts. So next year, I'm just going to have to be really strenuous in Christmas gifts and in uh, birthdays. So, you know, this year I spent like almost five, six hundred dollars on Jalen's birthday. That won't be happening no more. She's 11 years old. I ain't spending that much money on your birthday no more. Like, you about to get three hundred dollars, you know, or, you know, you about to get some gifts and we going to go out to eat. It ain't going to be no more of these damn parties and shit like that. Mm -mm. Like, <coughs> we could do... <coughs> A pizza party, which pizzas, like, that'll be $150. You invite all your friends over and drink pizza. You watch a movie, do what you do, and that'll be it. Have a little sleepover, whatever the case may be. But it's going to get wheeled back in 2018. And then this year, I got her a lot of stuff that she didn't have, but that will carry her over for years to come. So she won't really be needing that much next year. Um, so, yeah, I'm, I just got to get it together. I got to get a plan together figure out what my goals are actually i've already filled out figured out my goals either so a sneak peek of my 2018 budget goals pay as much as i can on this car like i'm trying to have my car paid off in 2019 which means i would have been paid it off two years early so i think this year i don't know how much i paid on it but next year i need to pay i know how much i owe because i won't make another payment to january so i started off with twenty thousand six hundred dollars on this truck that i bought and now i'm at seventeen thousand one hundred and forty six so next year i'm trying to pay at least ten thousand dollars on my car on the principal so i needed to be at seven thousand dollars by the end so i need to only owe seven thousand dollars by the end of next year on my car that is my goal to drop my car no by ten thousand dollars or is that eleven hundred i don't care seven thousand something but it needs to be close to seven thousand or under so that is my goal to pay ten thousand extra dollars on my car i don't know if i want to pay ten thousand extra like where that includes the regular payments or i want to pay the regular payments and still pay an additional ten thousand which in that case i should owe like six or something on my car by the end of next year so i have to figure that out i don't really know how that works 
but yeah that's what your girl needs to do for next year I sort of got a plan out next year of what I'm paying and how much I can pay based off my base salary with no overtime no nothing after my mom moves out my budget is straight up dry y'all like super totally dry like ain't gonna be no extra nothing y'all be like your ass ain't doing nothing it ain't gonna be nothing cuz I ain't gonna have nothing cuz I'm gonna have some gold some goals in my life so I think the next two years are gonna be real real rough looking it like it ain't gonna be no lot of extras or nothing unless you know I work overtime or something like that and get extra cash but I think even then I may take a little bit for me and Jalen but I think even then I'm gonna um I'm gonna what you call it I'm going to um what do you call it I'm going to uh, use that money to pay my car off. Like, like I got to get my life together. So then, I, um, what I was going to say, I, um, also I pay my son's cell phone bill, but I think he's going to start paying his own cell phone bill. He do work, work, study, and he make like 120 something, so he can pay $45, whatever, he'll be alright. Like, you need to pay your own bill. Get it together. That'll save me $45, I think. So, yeah. He need to pay his own bill. But, yeah, that's what I'm doing. I'm just plotting and scheming for 2018. If you haven't started thinking about 2018, if you're a budgeter, or just in general, you just need to think about where you want to be. Like, if your 2017 didn't go well for you, or you didn't get everything you thought you was going to get in 2017, or your plans didn't go as it was, new year, new goals, new um, expectations. Like, didn't reach my goals what I thought I would reach you know in 2018 but I damn near close I, I'm close I definitely definitely succeeded and outdid my 2017 budget expectations like I blew my budget out of the water I did I think a damn near a plus plus some now I don't make some state but compared to other years and things I used to do shit Kyosha did damn good with her money you thought my family thought I was frugal before, baby. They finna be. If they thought I was frugal this year, they ain't gonna be trying to even call me next year. Talking about something. We going here and we going. Nope, not in my budget. Nope, not in my budget. Nope, can't do that. Nope, can't do this. Like it's finna be on that level. It's finna be on that level. Like I don't cancel a whole trip for my birthday in 2019. So you know I'm serious when I don't cancel a whole trip. A whole trip that I was finna be planning. Yeah, your girl's serious. So, ooh, that's a nice Mercedes truck. I think probably expensive. I don't like how boxy it is, though, but that's cute. It looks more like an uh, off-road vehicle, even though it probably wouldn't make it on off-road, but such a life. But I think it's cute. It's nice and it's all boxy, though. Um, I have got to get some wrapping paper today. I have to wrap gifts, you guys. Like wrapping gifts are the bane of my existence like I hate wrapping gifts I'm the worst rapper in all of life as you can see with Ashley be opening up her gifts she be talking about somebody I be, I be taping it to death and she can't get it open because I be over here trying to make it look cute and it just don't it don't really work out like that you know it just really don't work out but I tried though that's all I gotta say so I tried so I've been talking for oh my god I'm talking for 13 minutes let me get off of this vlog I will see y'all a little bit later hey Bye. guys so I'm at the second job and I'm working it's like 721 and so they had the office Christmas party today so I can have free dinner I'm about to go make me a plate but this is the gift they gave us guys look so this this cute little tumbler I'm not gonna take it out of the package but this cute little tumbler mine is silver they let us pick colors they had like blue I think pink silver and another color i picked silver because i didn't know what they were going to get so it just has my name in black writing is this like my name and is it gray i think it's this gray right like dark gray writing and i think like the blue ones came with white writing but this is so pretty so i'm working on some of that and so what i'm about to do is head in this kitchen and make me some dinner i was talking to one of the doctors that's why i'm late getting dinner i know i shouldn't be eating dinner this late but that's what your girl gonna do anyway so let's go in here see what we can make and they got my favorite sows which is italian food and they got chicken alfredo i shouldn't have chicken alfredo but your girl gonna eat it anyway 
Let's see, they got plates in here. So they had a cake today. And they had brownies. And they got, oh, that was where those popcorn was in, but they don't have any more popcorn. Um, they don't have any more plates. Oh, here they are. I'm not gonna try to face y'all too much because, you know, might be private information in here and I don't wanna get in trouble. So I'm just gonna pop y'all up right here. Y'all, this is gonna be so freaking good. Yummy. Yum, yum, yum. But I'm not gonna sub y'all, subject y'all to me eating. So I'm gonna eat and get to some more working, and I'll be back to check in with y'all when I'm headed out the door. All right, bye. All right, you guys, I'm leaving work. Y'all, I smashed my damn fingers in the door. Oh, Lord, I swear. Oh, what am I doing myself? But yes, I am leaving. I'm tired. I'm finna get ready to get up out of here. So I'm going to bus show. I'll be out five thousand. almost i think i edited the vlog last night most of it but i didn't what i gotta do is bleep out all the cussing parts is what i have to do so that's gonna take me a minute because your girl was 38 hot yesterday really was so i'm gonna have to do that when i get home so it'll take me a little bit longer but i think i need to wrap some gifts when i get home Really Medical West Freestanding Emergency Department next to Sprouts on Alright you guys, so I will see y'all when I get home so I'm warm my car so it's gonna be really loud and um this is the radio and stuff. So I will see y'all when I get to the his eyes. So trying to get my I move it to work correctly. Something's going on with it. I know what it is. It's my my tower back here. It's almost full. Can you believe it? I've been I want to say YouTubing almost two years since I started back, and I bought that when I first started, and it's five terabytes, and it's almost full. Like that's how much stuff I have on it. So I'm trying to get it to export so that I can. Go ahead and get the vlog out for you guys tonight. File export. 
Why well, I can only do a 1080? I need to, my, it's probably my stupid intro. I mean, 720. Even though I'm not recording 1080. Yes, replace that, please. And hopefully it will get to doing what it's supposed to do this time. So I'm back. The vlog is exporting. So I can upload it. It is 10.32 at night. Yeah, see that? 10.32. And I'm about to wrap gifts, put some little ones in the gift bags and stuff. I can't really show you because they're not wrapped yet, you know, and people watch my vlog so they'll see what they got. So I'm going to wrap as much as I can, watch a little TV while I um, do it. And let's get to wrapping gifts. I would show you guys me wrapping the gifts, but like I said, they watch my vlogs and I don't want to know what I got, what they got. <laughs> yeah, what I got for them. So I'll just be back when I'm either tired of wrapping and show you what I wrap, and then I'll do the rest another day, or whatever the case may be. But I will come back and close out the vlog later on. It's a super duper late. It's 11:40, so I'm about to peace out on this vlog. I will show you what I've wrapped. Let's see if I can not show other stuff. Hold on. But I wrapped the gift from my mom from us, and then these are some gifts down here and gifts right there. So I'm gonna put them under the tree. But I still have like I don't know, like a lot of gifts to wrap. So it is what it is. I'm about to go put what I wrapped already under the tree. And hopefully the kids tomorrow will be trying to shake up the damn packages and stuff. Whatever. And then I still have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, like ten or twelve more gifts to wrap. So yeah, I got glue all on my face and everything. So yeah, good night, you guys, and I will see y'all tomorrow in Vlogmas Day. What day we gonna be on, y'all? This 21 I'm uploading. Today's 22, then 23. I'll see y'all tomorrow in Vlogmas Day 23. And the video got two seconds before it's live. So I'll see you guys later. Bye.